the spare got a liking. As Mike Tyndall announced his release, an explosive book, unmasking the Sussex's horror secret. Mike Tyndall, who is the son-in-law of Princess Anne, has described himself as an open book, ahead of entering the jungle. As the 44-year-old had married Zara Phillips, in the first royal, to take part in the I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here. Before, a source had told the Daily Mail that the monarch wouldn't have approved of him signing off for the show. And despite this, Micah said he is an open book, seemingly implying that he isn't afraid to share his stories. Mike Tyndall has already spilled the tea on the life in the royal family, on his years on I'm a Celebrity. Last night he recounted the tale of his wife Zara dramatically giving birth to their son Lucas on their bathroom floor. After the midwife insisted that she wouldn't make it to the hospital. As the England rugby player and legend at 44 had married the Princess Anne's daughter, has shared candid details in the past about his regal family's private life, which is unusual for a royal. And in addition, Mike also recalled things about Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. As before, a royal correspondent has revealed, the royal family has raised no objections over Mike Tyndall's I'm a celebrity appearance. As King Charles was informed, before, a royal correspondent has revealed that the royal family has raised no objections over Mike Tyndall's I'm a celebrity appearance. As King Charles has informed throughout the process, Charles had said, we also have to remember that Mike and Zara are not working royals, and therefore they do not get anything from the Sovereign House grant, as the couple rely on their sponsorship work and their links to sport. I expect Mike will be well aware of that, and what he can say and he cannot say, whilst on the show, as he is shrewd, so I wouldn't expect that he would reveal any family secrets. However, that does not mean that some people will not want to cause mischief and quiz him on the royals, particularly Harry and Meghan, as Mike has appeared on the various programs in the past and he has managed to keep quiet about the family matters. Recently, they are that Mike Tyndall has been writing a book sharing his views on Harry and Meghan before and after Mexit. As it comes after Prince Harry had announced the date, of releasing his memoir. There are speculations that Harry has included personal attacks against King Charles and other senior royals in the upcoming biography. Prince Harry, who is set to release his wholly anticipated memoir early next year, has faced backlash for being unkind to attack King Charles. As the royal author Angela Levin had slammed the Duke of Sussex for focusing his attention on his past grievances with the king rather than on his new family, as she alleged that the Duke and Duchess of Sussex want to destroy the royal family. Levin, while speaking to Sky News Australia, had flayed the Duke for choosing Spare as the title of his memoir, saying it is a tragedy. As Levin went on, and to try and attack his parents when King Charles is really grieving for his mother, is so unkind to do that. Whereas former BBC royal correspondent Jenny Bond shared that the royal family is likely to have been saddened to read the title of the book. During a conversation with OK, Meghan had said, It is going to be Harry and Meghan's show at the end of the year, and the beginning of next with a docuseries and Harry's book. They'll be dominating the headlines, which is presumably what they want to do. As I think Harry's book will be more controversial than the Netflix docuseries, because the title is searingly honest. I imagine that the royals were a bit sad when they had heard the name, as it is sad, and that is how he has felt all his life.